thought you were until midnight. Yeah, so did I. Must have read the rotor on. Mm. You've been a bit distracted recently. Yeah, well, you know, I mean, work's busy, isn't it? Got a lot on my mind. Mm. Well, why don't we go for a nice, relaxing meal tonight, then, at the bistro? I could ask Izzy to man Liam. Yeah, I mean, I'd love to do that, but I've got a colleague's leaving you to go to, so i kind of got to go. Please don't lie to me, Ali. I'm not lying to you. You know, I've been out with some really good liars over the years. I'm actually quite relieved that you're bad at it. If you're not feeling this, just let me know, yeah? Hey, of course I'm feeling this. I know that you're going out with Emma tonight. OK, I've heard your little secret chats, and I overheard you before when you thought I was still in the toilet. Certainly explains why you've been distracted. Oh. <laughs> oh, what, you think this is funny? <laughs> yeah. Well, wow. really do pick on me, don't I? Emma, you're welcome to it. Hey, oh, oh, oh. hang on a minute. You've... No, 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 you've, you've got this really wrong, OK? Cos, actually, we were organising a surprise for you. Oh, pull the other one. It's true, I was going to babysit Liam tonight. Yeah, which is why I have booked us a hotel and ordered a taxi and packed him an overnight bag. I don't believe you. Look, you can ask Steve about the taxi and look in the back of your wardrobes where I've hid your bag. You can ask Bethany. She knew an all. Yeah, you know, I just figured that if, look, if Daniel and Sinead could have a surprise wedding, then we could have a surprise getaway, yeah? Well, what about this attached bloke that you fancy in then? Oh, he's a client. You know, Charles, the posh one with the floppy hair. Ah, oh, the one who moans about his girlfriend all the time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, I've been such an idiot. Yeah, but you're a gorgeous idiot. I'm not so <laughs> mad about you. Come here. <laughs> <laughs>